country. You may have heard of it, uh, Western Canada. And we're doing something that no one expected in Calgary, and that's developing a full-stack hardware company. Um, we're a young company. We were founded in July of 2016, um, and in the last year, we've seen phenomenal growth. Um, we moved into our new manufacturing facility in Calgary with 24 people, and on Monday, we welcomed our 202nd employee. So we're riding a rocket ship, and we need your help. I wish I was talking to you about robots. Well, this is, unfortunately, I am talking to you about robots. Um, this is our presentation for this afternoon. But I'll share this with you anyway, because you can get the idea. We've developed the first uh, robotic-based 3D storage and retrieval solution using um, the first robotic 3D shuttles. We move bins around, but we move them around better than anybody else. Um, that matrix that they were climbing in is what we need your help with, because we build both the monkeys and the monkey bars. We have produced, so far to date, 12,000 of our structure modules. Um, we make ladders. We make lots and lots of ladders. We're seen as a robotics company, but the foundation of what we do is based off geometry. So with over 12,000 of these ladders that we produced in the last nine months, we want to automate the process. We use laser tube cutting to take aluminum extrusions and then fabricate them into these structural modules. And right now they're manually assembled and manually riveted. So we're looking at partners that can work both in pick and place, automa um, automated fixture building, and uh, we want to explore robotic flow screw fastening. And uh, we're hoping to find those partners here today. The, I would love if you could. Yes, thank you. So a little bit about um, our company. Um, we were inspired by highly successful natural systems um, to reimagine storage and retrieval technology. Um, ADA is actually the Latin name for leaf cutter ants. And we looked at the way ants build their colonies. Uh, human beings are a two-dimensional species. We walk on the ground. We drive on the ground. So we need rows and aisles to access all of our storage. Ants and termites actually uh, access all of their goods vertically. And this was a fundamental shift for us in thinking. There we go. So to, to change the way we access goods to a vertical and create a 3D robotic shuttle, um, this is back to the ladders we were discussing. When we're producing this, this year, 12,000 of these, it's an intensely manual process. The laser cutting of small openings also is one of the slowest processes. So we want to find partners that can help us in the assembly and material handling um, of these modules. So we've explored other technologies. Um, we're hoping to come to the heart of, of Canada's manufacturing environment and find those partners that can work with us to entirely automate this process in, in three steps, ideally over the next 12 months. So the other part of our technology um, we already use our robots to build our robots. I have every mad scientist dream of having robots building robots to take over the world. Um, our technology allows any robot to go get any coat from any location, deliver it to any location, and then sequence it in any order. Right now, that material handling and that flow is done in an entirely manual process. And by integrating our technology, hopefully with yours, um, for pick and place, fastening, positioning, um, and QC, we're looking at those opportunities um, to merge our technology to drive true industry 4.0 flexible manufacturing processes. As I said, we can deliver anything anywhere in any sequence, um, so bringing the parts, bringing the fixture into a single location, and then working with the automation integrator, integrators that hopefully are here, we'd like to find a path forward um, to achieve my dream. So, thank you very much.